Let's say that I have content in a Microsoft Word document and I want to upload that to Google Docs as part of the Open Course Library project. One um, possibility would be to save my Word document and then upload it and have it convert to a Google Doc format. But there might be uh, good reasons why I don't want to do that. Maybe I have uh, mathematical formulas or, or complex tables or, or embedded images, things that don't translate over to Google Docs format very well, and I want to just upload this and keep it in Microsoft Word format. So the first thing I'm going to do is while I'm still in Microsoft Word, I'm going to go to File, Save As, and I'm going to choose to save this as a Microsoft Word 1997 to 2003 or DOC format file as opposed to a DOCX doc, docx. So on the save file, save as type, by default it's going to say uh, word document dot DOCX, but I want to change that to 97 2003. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is that this is a format which is more transferable to um, a lot of the systems or programs that, that the consumer might be using down the road. So I'm saving this as a 2003 format and I'll save it uh, on my desktop and give it a title. Okay. Now I'm going to hop over to Google Docs and here I am logged in. I can see my home with all of my different documents, and over on the side I have collections and sub-collections. And I can cr I have a create button. I also have an upload button here. Uh, so I'm going to click on that. I'm going to upload uh, files in this case, and I'm going to go to my desktop and find my document that I just created. There it is, and I'll open that. And now this is the important part. It's it, by default it's asking me to keep the checkbox for convert documents, presentation spreadsheets to Google Docs format. If I don't want it to be converted, I want it to stay in Word format. I'm going to uncheck those boxes and click uh, Start Upload. Okay, so it's going to show me a little window here telling me that it is uploading the document. And when that's done. and the upload is complete, I now see uh, upload complete here, and I also see the Gettysburg address .doc file that I just uploaded. Notice that uh, Google Docs have a sort of a square with a little, red write a little white writing on it as an icon, and this has a, a W that looks similar to a Microsoft Word icon. So I now know that this is up in Google Docs here for me, and I'll close that notification. Okay, so I could just leave it there, and treat it like I would any other document in my collection, or if I w or in my Google Google Docs, or if I wanted to put it into a collection, I can drag and drop it from my home screen into the collection where I want it to reside. Now, if I look in the example collection here, I'll see that I have both the subfolder listed there, or sub collection, and then my uh, my Word document. I can again, I can move it around by dragging and dropping it on to other locations if I want. And that's, then I'm done.